Sandy, and this is the Aqueduct, the first ever shipboard water coaster here aboard the Disney Dream Cruise Ship. High-powered water jets on Aqueduct pump about 10,000 gallons of water per minute, actually accelerating you uphill through portions of the ride. Disney has always been known as a company that finds the latest and coolest technology and then harnesses that tech to make a little Disney magic. Here aboard the Disney Dream, that kind of technical innovation is everywhere. Check out the Magic Play Floor in Disney's Oceaneer Club and Disney's Oceaneer Lab, areas designed for kids from ages 3 to 10. The Magic Play Floor is kind of like a giant video game, but one where you have to move to play. All around the Disney Dream, you'll see framed art, but it's not just any art. Some of it is enchanted. It magically comes alive once a guest steps close. The ship's enchanted art is also part of a ship-wide interactive game. You play detective as you hold a game card in front of some enchanted art. Clues are revealed and missing objects found, helping you find the villain and save the day. Two more puppies rescued. Good show. The magic continues in the Disney Dream staterooms. 88% of staterooms face the outside of the ship, and 90% of those rooms have a private veranda. But for the 150 inside staterooms, Disney has created a high-tech cruise industry first, a magical porthole. A porthole-shaped monitor on the wall shows a live feed from a camera on the ship's deck, sometimes with a magical flyby from animated Disney characters. Technology also brings a special visit to your dining experience. Each night, the Animator's Palette Restaurant transforms from animation studio to an undersea experience, complete with a visit from Crush, the surfer sea turtle dude from Disney Pixar's Finding Nemo. Crush swims from screen to screen around the restaurant, talking live with guests. Hello, you the dudes! And we're back to Aquada. I know it may look a little zipping around the deck like that, but it's a blast. Here I go! Your ride actually starts with a swing-out loop with an awesome view of the ocean surface about 150 feet below. In all, it's 760 feet of ups and downs, and since the tube is clear, you can wave at everyone on the pool decks as you glide through. You've got to come try!